If you are looking to get paid to vote in this prediction exchange, uh, this is a great website to consider doing it. So if you're really into p politics or financial events or things like that, and you've always wanted to kind of guess what might happen, Predicted offers just that. And make sure to subscribe to the channel, like this video, and comment below your own input on Predicted.org if you'd like. But I'm just going to get jumping right into it here that if you're not familiar, Predicted is a New Zealand-based prediction market that offers prediction exchanges on political and financial events. As you can see here, this is the website. Uh, you simply just deposit money in and you start voting, and that's pretty much it. Pretty straightforward. You get the browse the markets. Check out the range of available markets on which you can try and predict the outcome. In 2020, basically, you can predict something like if you think Trump's going to get reelected, if you think he's going to get kicked out of office, things like that. You can make a prediction, think everybody's got it wrong, put your money in where your mouth is, and buy shares for or against an event taking place. Then you trade your shares by your shares low and sell them high once the crowd figures out you were right or if you're wrong then you pretty much lose that investment so it's pretty much uh you could say it's high risk but if you know a little bit about politics and ethical stuff and things like that some of these that are kind of 50 50 you can be making 30 percent 40 percent return on investment sometimes even more than that so if you put a hundred dollars in and you voted against something uh and you ended up being right on that, depending on the percentages here. I'll show you here, guys, just in a second. So you can see here, will the Senate convict Donald Trump on impeachment in his first term? You have the 10 cents, 91 cents. You have yes for 10 cents. You have 91 cents for no. So... Uh, using this as a factor here, you can accrue basically that percentage of profit if you ended up being right. So if you did the no vote here at 91 cents, and then obviously they ended up being wrong, and he does end up not getting convicted, basically, that means that you'd get the leftover return from the people that thought yes. So there's a room for profit there, and people would be dumping basically their equivalent shares for the uh, market, so to speak. You have a little rules thing here. And then it's during Donald Trump's first term as president of the United States, the U.S. Senate shall, by a vote of at least two-thirds of the members, president convict Mr. Trump on one or more articles of impeachment. So basically, if it matches those rules, then yes would be correct. So if he does end up getting kicked out so to speak if you did the yes you put 10 cents and he ends up getting kicked out you'd make all of the other side of the flip side of the coin because the shares would go up on the yes side and then they go down on the no side so you'd lose the monies if you were on the no you gain the monies on the yes if he did end up getting impeached pretty straightforward system isn't anything complicated some of them have different uh votes for if like uh, you think uh, trump's going to tweet x number of times you think trump is going to resign in his first term that's another easy one the answer is no so you can make the profit right there that's a 10 percent return on investment so for every dollar you put in you make 10 cents if you put in a hundred dollars you will make 10 bucks fairly easily there isn't much risk on that obviously you're in the uh, Trump's the way his personality is he's not going to be leaving in the first term so and just to cover some basics here you can uh, withdraw your monies to a bank through check that's pretty much the only two options that they offer they don't offer PayPal they don't offer anything else there's a percentage fee if you get it sent to you via check I think it's five percent so you can deposit the monies control them just as easily. I personally like the check method. You get a nice little fancy check that you can deposit in the bank. And I don't use this very often, but sometimes I get 100, 200 bucks every other month when I do actually actively use it. I would say for this upcoming election time, these is the best. This is one of the best times to get in to predict it because outside of the kind of political drama there, there's some obvious entries for betting on politics for the elections for the u.s elections at least 
Now it breaks down in a bunch of different categories here. This is the trends category. Where's the smart money going? Uh, most of predict uh, its top traders have sold this contract in the last 24 hours. It's tweets related. Uh, today's most predicted contract was of traders who made this was Trump tweets between 12:18 and 12:31. Then you have the latest polls for the Democratic uh, nomination, generic congressional polling, presidential job approval, congressional job approval, top comments, and so on. Jumping into the next area here, you've got leaderboards, and leaderboards show in the last week. So as you can see here, in the last week, someone made over 829% return on investment. That's a huge percentage of return. So if you had $1,000 in, you would have made $829 if you just followed whatever he invested in, in whatever shares he decided to pick. Now we're going to go jump into the past month. Give an idea of the percentages. Someone in the past month made 901%. Someone made 897%. So these are huge percentages, and a lot of these are kind of common sense yes or no's. You're not going to see get, Trump get impeached. You're probably not going to see him, you know, quit. You're probably not going to see him do any of this dramatic stuff, and there's a lot of leeway on that. And then just to break down here. In the last year, some people made 2,548% at the top here, and then it goes kind of trailing down that uh, even in the top 50, you got someone that made 338%, you got someone that made 290%, and so on. You see, I think you get the point. Percentages again, percentages again. And basically, these are different ranking systems in Predicted. And you can see that some people make better percentages than others. And this is considered more like the intro ranking area here. And as you can see, there's still people that just literally just started that are making 895% return on investment. Some of the kind of categories you'll see, they expire after whatever the case is. You can see who do you think is going to be the 2020 Democratic nominee, Joe Biden, Bernie Sanders. You got the 2020 presidential winner. You got Donald Trump at 47 cents. You got Joe Biden at 23 cents. So on, if you're thinking in that regard here that it, you got Joe Biden and you got Trump, obviously Trump is likely going to be the winner unless they present someone a little bit more appealing to the masses. I don't really see Biden winning that. So that in itself is a huge profit margin right there. So with the 47 cents, it can go up to 100. So that means that you can make the percentage in between that. So that would be the basically 53 cents. So you would make 53 cents off of a $47 47 cents investment so if you bought enough shares of that you can kind of see why that would be a valuable return on your investment you got all these other ones here you got which party wins the presidency in 2020 democratic republican same thing here democrats are apparently hopeful but i don't really see that again i feel that trump's just going to win again so i would actually vote for the republican side and there's a huge value in between here you can make almost another 100 percent return on investment obviously it's going to take a little bit to process and get to that point and of course you don't even have to necessarily even hold it the whole way through you can sell at any point that you want to sell the for the profit for the shares if that fluctuates to any degree so that's something to keep in mind as well you got will trump be president at the end of 2019 yes obviously 2019 is like less than a week uh, about a week away not too long uh, a little bit over a week but uh you know yes no obviously you missed the boat on that one but you'd want one that has sort of uh in between you got will trump complete the first term yes no uh, there some people feel that it's still no obviously that's going to be a yes that's you know that's another easy return on your investment that's 14 cents 14 dollars if you put 14 you get the point that it's basically you'll get the 14 cents per each share if 
he ends up completing his first term. Obviously, a Senate convict Trump in the first term, it's not going to happen in my opinion. But some people say yes, some people say no. There's a 10 cent uh, differentiation on that one. You got another category here. This is just a broad U.S. government. And of course, make sure to subscribe to this channel and like this video and comment below if you have had success with predicted.org. But as you can see here, you got trade volume, price change, new arrivals, and expiring soon. Expiring soon ones are sometimes good to get into if there's a little bit of a fluctuation where you might be able to squeeze out a few cents here and there. And if you bought uh, like the equivalent of 100 shares of it, you might be able to squeeze out a few bucks when the outcome's already been predicted. So that's something to consider as well. I'll do another video if anyone's interested on strategies that I've used in the past through Predicted, but I mostly just play the complete common sense no risk at all, to, in my opinion, and I've actually never lost on Predicted, which is kind of funny, considering it's political and I don't really follow politics that much. It's another category, just a world here. Uh, it's not necessarily just focused on specifically the U.S., and then you got uh, just different little predictions here. Will Kim be North Korea leader on 1231? 99 cents says yes, 1 cent says no, and then obviously you can see that some of these are a little late to the game for them. Uh, will there be a Trump uh, meeting by 1231? Will this happen, this happen, so on and so forth? This is just world-related predictions. And that's about all I wanted to cover in this video. If you wanted to check it out, it's a great website. It's The returns on investments are fairly easy to make. There isn't much of a, I would consider, any realistic risk when you're utilizing Predicted. But obviously, you don't want to take the more broad, more gambling-related. Let me jump to that here. To the actual categories here. You'd want someone that's uh, something that's more guaranteed. Uh, like uh, this is a silly one here. Will Michelle run in twenty twenty? I really don't think so. Uh, apparently, the majority don't either. Some people are trying to gamble that maybe she will, and then if she ends up doing that for whatever the reason, that's a big return on the investment. Some of these are a little bit broader, as you can see here. Just like clicking through here, will Oprah run in 2020? I don't really see that happening. I believe she even said she wasn't interested at one point. But you have a three cent discrepancy here, so you can literally make three bucks fairly easily with just a hundred buck investment on that. And <laughs> these are some of these are kind of hilarious to me. A woman president in 2020. Yes, no. Uh, some people are taking a gamble that maybe, yes, I feel Trump's going to win again, but that's just my input. If you want to comment below your own input on this, feel free to share. I'll be doing other videos like this of ways you can make monies online through PayPal or check or whatever amount. In this case, Predicted uses checks. Thanks for listening in and have a nice day.